Chris here with the Colorado Avalanche Information Center. Traveling here in the La Plata Mountains in between Bedrock and Madison Creek. As you can tell, it's snowing pretty hard. We picked up about 10 inches so far out of the storm here in the La Plata's wind drifted areas. There's 14, 16 inches. And as you can see, it's easy for this new snow to break. And we've noticed some cracking along some wind drifted spots on the ridges. We're here on a slope where it avalanched back in mid-January and we're finding about 30 inches of snow that's sitting on top of some weaker sugary facets on top of a firm bed surface. <laughs> Yikes! The problem moving forward here in the La Plata is, as we build more of a load, is that we have a lot of slopes that avalanche in mid-January. These slopes with these weak sugary facets above a harder bed surface are primed and ripe and ready to avalanche again. So. As we get more snow in this storm, we just need to remember to give steeper terrain, a wider buffer, and avoid wind-loaded spots uh, so we don't trigger a large dangerous avalanche.